You said the woman was out here in the parking lot, and yes. she comes into Carl's Jr. where you're working. And what happened? Okay, so I came out of the bathroom, and she was already in the dining room, and people were taking care of her. And I was trying to find some, some tools to help her, and I found a bungee cord, and I tied that around her leg to stop the blood flow. She was shot in the leg. Do you know which leg? I think it was the left leg. High, low, like uh, the below the... Part of the leg near the calf area. Okay. Yeah. Uh, was, she in, was she crying? Was she screaming? She was relaxed. She was not crying, no screaming. She was just, uh, you know, she was scared, you know, of course, but not in shock. And, and how did you describe her? What she looked like? Uh, she was like a young Asian lady, probably in her 20s. Did she work at YouTube? I really don't know, honestly. Did she have any idea why she would be targeted? No, I don't think she knew anything like that. Did she say anything about that? No, no. She didn't even know why. Did she explain to you what she saw? Uh, she just told me that she got shot, and I don't think she even sh uh, saw the shooter or anything like that, because she didn't tell me any info like that. How did you spell your last name again? I'm sorry. All right, that's, Mike, that's Michael Finney, who works at the Carl's Jr., which is uh, kind of kitty-cornered here in this uh, plaza, the San Bruno Plaza, and he treated the young victim. We don't know her name, but he says she was young, she was Asian, shot in the left leg, and he used a bungee cord as a tourniquet to stop the bleeding until first responders could get her to the hospital. Ken. So, Jesse, uh, so he was at the Carl's Jr. at work, and this woman just basically stumbled in with a gunshot wound to the leg. Is that what happened? That is that's exactly right, Ken. Apparently she was out here somewhere when the shooting started, and whether she was directly targeted or hit by a random bullet, we do not know, but she was shot in her left leg, came into the Carl's Jr. He came out of the back, saw the commotion, decided to try and help, grabbed a bungee cord to wrap that around her leg to, to lessen the blood flow until first responders could get